In this illustration, we intend to simulate RWS connection with elliptical opening in the BIM web in the Abacus software. As you observe in this picture, the model is composed of BIM, column, continuity plate, doubler web plates, and stiffener. As you observe in this picture, an elliptical hole has been created on the BIM web. In this example, a cyclic loading is applied to the BIM and following that, the hysteresis diagram of the model will be drawn. In this picture, the hysteresis diagram obtained from the Abacus software has been compared with experimental results. Here, the formation of the model undergoing a cyclic loading can be observed. In the last picture, the deformation obtained from the Abacus software has been compared with the experimental results. Actually, we intend to simulate this article in the Abacus software. The article is entitled Cyclic Behavior of welded elliptical shaped RWS moment frame. In the right picture, you can observe the model having been simulated in the Abacus software. In this picture, you can observe the hysteresis diagram of the model. Translate instance, select the beam, done. First, select this point, then this one, and OK. In the next step, I will enter geometric shape of stiffener into the assembly section and rotate that 90 degrees about X axis. After that, I'll rotate stiffener 90 degrees about Y axis. In this table, you can observe the properties of different parts of the model. First, I intend to define the properties of beam flange. I will click on mechanical menu, then on elasticity and elastic. Young modulus is equal to 196.5 gigapascal. Poisson ratio is equal to 0 0.3. After that, I click on mechanical menu, then on plasticity and plastic. Yield stress is equal to 265.1. Ultimate stress is equal to 405.3 megapascal.
As you observe, the results gained from the Abacus software are very close to experimental results. In the next step, uh, we intend to draw the hysteresis diagram of the model. Actually, we intend uh, to draw this diagram here. I will click on Create XY Data, select ODB History Output, and Continue. I will select all reaction forces Click on Save As, and then sum them up all together. I will click on Create XY Data, on Operate on XY Data, and Continue. I will select U3 and divide that by 1135 millimeters. And one 1135 millimeters is actually the distance between the place of loading and the center of column. As you observe here, and you can observe that here, select force and multiply that by 1.135 and, uh, and this figure is the same the distance between the place of loading and the center of column Here I will uh, click on Combine. First I select Rotation and then Moment and click on Save As. Here you can observe the hysteresis diagram having been drawn in the Abacus software. I will transfer that to the Excel software. The first column is rotation, the unit of which is radian. The second column is moment, the unit of which is newton meter.
The diagram having been drawn in red is the one obtained from the Abacus software. As you observe, the results gained from the Abacus software are very close uh, to the experimental results, indicating that this question has been simulated correctly in the Abacus software.